Stevie was definitely the smallest stray that I had seen. I was on a solo trip. I was riding my scooter and I just stopped. She came right to me and I picked her up. I didn't plan on taking her home by any means. I took her with me on the scooter to a cafe, ate some chicken, and then I let her down. She just laid down thinking I was just leaving her. That killed me, but I was like, no, you're, you're coming back with me to my bungalow. The first few days, there were signs that she was sick. The first episode happened in the middle of the night. I let her out and she just fell over on her side. I didn't start playing with the idea to bring her back until she was sick. It made me realize how much I loved her and I didn't want to give up on her. When Stevie first had her episode, I only had about five days left in Bali before I was planning on coming back to the States. I pretty much lived in Bali for three months because of her. I probably went to the vet 20 times trying to find answers. Stevie, we're going to America. We're going to America today. I love you. It's actually illegal to fly dogs in or out of Bali. In order for her to fly home, she had to be transported from Bali to Jakarta by a local transportation company. The Indonesians who had her, they were very sweet because they would let me FaceTime with her. They would send me photos and videos to let me know that it was all going to be okay. Hi, Steph. Welcome to Jakarta. The reuniting in Jakarta was one of the happiest moments. It was a long journey. She loves life in America. She went from the Indian Ocean to the Rocky Mountains. Stevie usually wakes me up by licking my face, and then we will cuddle, and then she will follow me all around my condo until I put my shoes on, and she knows that that means we are going on a hike. We probably go on four to five hikes a week, and she loves it. She loves the mountains. Stevie will still go nuts anytime I come home, even if I've just been gone for an hour. I think that we just both prefer not to be separated. <laughs> I love you. I found her the day before the 15th anniversary of my dad's death. She's just the best gift that I could have ever received. Like, comment, and subscribe.